Come on, come on. Oh, is that a tiger eye set in gold? Nice. Oh my There's gosh. Oh, snap. Dad, 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 dad. Here, here, here. Dad, dad, open this, open this. Oh, open I think it? it's gold, I think it's gold. It can't be. I'm telling you. Ooh. That is gold. Tag $850. What? For an AR-15. That's an AR? Oh. oh my gosh. Open it up, open it up, open it up. It. Come uh, on, open it up. Uh. <laughs> my name's Thomas and I'm an online reseller. Every week, I search all over for some real bargains. I find all sorts of cool stuff. So follow me on my journey and hit that subscribe button. Unfortunately, I've lost my voice a little bit. So if you hear sounds like birds squeaking, just know no birds were harmed in the making of this video. It is just my voice. <laughs> it's just a chipmunk. <laughs> yeah, but this week has been one of the craziest weeks for us ever. I think it's a really big turning point for us because how many units did we buy, Dad? We bought five storage units yesterday. We bought five storage units. And they are all 10 by 20s. This is... Well, all, one, one is bigger, isn't it? There's a 10 by 25, a 10 by 30, and the rest are all 10 by 20s. And we ended up spending a little more than we wanted to. There was a little lesson we learned. Because uh, a few days before we bought the units, we called and asked, hey, if we were to rent these storage units, how much would it cost? And they all were like, oh, we've got dollar specials going on. But then we get to the storage units. It was $200, not Nobody's dollar. got dollar specials. We ended up spending an extra $1,000. So just we spent, to rent them. Just to rent them, just in renting costs for the extra units. So we ended up spending $4,000 on storage units. So we have a lot of money to make back and hopefully this is a good start to it. This unit is a 10 by 25 and has been here for almost 10 years. They've spent over 10, maybe even over $20,000 to keep the stuff inside this unit. That's and we crazy. got it for only $350. How much? $350, let's crack it open. Oh you wanna do the right? honors? You wanna do the honors? <laughs> 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 That is dusty. Oh, right off the bat, we've got these wicker, a wicker chair and a wicker table. A little bit of damage to these, but if we find a whole set, even though it's damaged, it'll probably be $100. Hey, we got a broom. We got a broom. We can clean out the unit when we're done. You can clean it out before we stuff. Is that vintage, vintage Barbies? And then there's totes. There's totes under these boxes. We've got picture frames. We've got a ton of cool stuff to get through. And I have no idea where to begin. Okay, so we got a little bit of the stuff out. We've got some artwork to look at. Ooh, some of this stuff is actually pretty cool. Look at that, it's like wolf. And it's got a cool wooden frame. Is this a table? Oh, I think that's a table. Oh, that's signed. Whatever that is, that's signed. Uh -huh. Oh my gosh. There's some doors. We've seen some water damage to some yeah, of this stuff. Yeah, look at how high the water came in here. I don't know if that came in here, though. Because it had to have, because this don't get wet like that. You see, all these are all wet. This isn't same wet, height. though. That's not wet. Yes, it is. It got wet. Is it? So did that. Oh, that wouldn't be good. That wouldn't be good. We're finding a lot of things that are like movie stuff. Like oh, old posters. That's not movie. This is this meatloaf. Is meatloaf? It's a band. It's a rock band? Yeah. Oh, we might find, we might sign tour shirts, vintage tour shirts in this unit maybe. Wait, look at these movie posters that got damaged by the water. That is so sad. Oh man. That's a signed piece, but it looks like the water got to it. Uh-huh. So we have to look at the stuff carefully from this unit for, because even like cool collectible stuff like this might not be sellable anymore. This movie poster we just found is signed in multiple places, but it has been, it's got water damage on the bottom of it. So I don't know if that's gonna take away all the value. I mean, a, a signature by itself should have hold some value. This might be a vintage Disney t-shirt. Let me look at this tag. And made in the USA. Oh. Vintage Disney shirts could be worth some money. 1993. It doesn't have like Mickey Mouse or anything on it, but still, I have to look that up. Like at least it should, at the very least it should be like 15, 20 bucks. Here's some more cool stuff we just pulled out of some of these boxes. Exclusive fan, uh, I don't know about that. Um, but we got another chicken. This chicken was with this one. We got a Native American uh, dream catcher and then more of this uh, farm style, a lot of this farm style stuff. 
And this chicken is actually some kind of stone. And he's made in Greece. So this is actually eBay. And these are eBay, but the rest of it is like good flea market stuff. Mixed tools. I want you mixed to mix tools. Mixed tools. Mixed tools. What's that for mixed? These are some weird looking tools. Weird looking. Tempo by Mado. Uh, we might be able to put some of the larger plates together and have actually some sellable stuff. But this is water damage, right? Oh, yeah. But. But I mean, plates can, that's plates, you know? Plates get washed, they can, they can be wet. Luckily for us, there's a lot of stuff that is stacked up really high, but you can actually see where the water came in and we did not notice that. I didn't notice that when I was bidding on the unit. But um, I, I think, I think we'll still, we'll still definitely make money on the unit, but we have to really pick and choose what we want to buy and what we want to sell. Hey, you want to open this? Sure. Ooh. I said this over a little ring box. Where are you going? That's it. You gave it to me. I gave it to you to look at. Oh, I was, <coughs> going, to, I was going over here. Ooh. What are you doing? What do you mean, ooh? You're messing with me. You're messing with me. Ooh. Oh, no way. No way. Is that gold? I don't know, but it sure is pretty. It's huge. Wow. Oh, my gosh. I'm, I'm going to take the ring out. I don't know if it's gold. Oh, my goodness. It's got a marking. I see it. There's a mark on it? Yeah, right here. No, that's not gold. Oh. No? You but sure? We might find some jewelry. We might find some jewelry, and that'll pay this unit back really quick if we do. So you weren't giving me this? No. Oh. Mine. Oh. Ha, ha, ha. Thomas, you have no idea. These people, These people? They've, they've actually met Meatloaf, the band Meatloaf. Really? Yeah, it says meet and greet passes. Huh. Dude. And then, are these, you, you saved a bunch of CDs, too. Are yeah. these all meatloaf or are they just no. good ones? Just these two meatloaf. There's only two meatloafs? Yeah. Oh. Uh, because if they had a Look bunch of that. if they had a bunch of meatloaf stuff, we could put all the meatloaf stuff together in a lot, like a bunch of meatloaf CDs. You we might could. get like over fifty to hundred dollars for that. I don't know. Well, we got a tote. I don't think the water could have touched this stuff, and I think we got some vintage toys. Are these Legos? Hey dad, we got Legos. Uh-uh. And I see WWE stuff. Oh boy. There could be some money. Oh, Princess Diana doll. Look, Tidini baby doll. <laughs> oh, wow. I learned my lesson on this one. See them online selling from thousands of dollars, but they're everywhere. They're all over the place. Maybe some of the, if we make a lot of these uh, characters, these, yeah. these characters might sell. Oh, there's a ton of them. There's a ton of them in there. And there's Star Wars stuff in there, too. Oh, man. Oh, this is a Luigi hat. Okay, this entire tote is a cool tote. This tote's cool. I see Pokemon cards in there, too. Look at that. Imagine we find some 90s Pokemon cards in this unit. I would freak out. I would freak out. Okay, I gotta start. I gotta speed up a little bit. I'm a little slow. Taking this stuff out of here. Okay, yeah, all these, uh, all these guys together. We'll make a lot of them. I don't know how much we're gonna get for it. We'll throw the belt in too. Ooh, yeah. Whoa. You okay? Yeah. Are you crying? No, I just sound like you. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. This. Okay, so we got a bunch of new stuff in here. Probably the best lot of stuff we've found so far. Oh, Star Wars minifigures. Uh -uh. Lego Star Wars minifigures, Dad. Nice. Here we go. There's some money right here. Here we go. <laughs> with my with my raspy voice. Okay, guys. A little trivia, real quick. What is the one thing you find in every storage unit? Make your guesses in the comments. It's a. I know. I know. Oh, 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 oh. What is it? I'm hiding. I'm hiding it. I'm it's hiding. It's a forty-year-old virgin. What? <laughs> no. It's DVDs. Every single storage unit has DVDs in it. We find them every single time. If you guys guess right, you win. Um, I don't know. Maybe you get high fives. What is this? Oh, Dad! I found a gun. Really? Ooh. Ooh. Careful. You call Ben? Careful. I wanted to give a shout out. Oh. High profile, 4x4. My buddy Ben. Yeah, Ben and Josh made this trailer happen. We would not be doing this storage unit. I don't right. think, we would not be doing this storage unit right now. Love those guys. 
Ah! What? You get scared? He jumped out. I was. <laughs> and he jumped out. Oh. Oh, that box looks Look. awesome. Look at that car. That's all movie like stuff. No yeah. way. This is cool. Yeah, that they... box is going to make us some money. Hey, Let's hope. You know why? Ching, ching is right. Ching. I gotta get through oh, all. Ah. Chucky. Oh, <laughs> but I gotta get through all these. I gotta get through all these before I can get to that. I can't yeah. jump the gun. Oh. Look at this really nice thing. What is that? Is that a picture and everything. Oh, well, I mean this. I'm sorry. Oh. What? Uh, I hear stuff. I hear. I hear. I hear. I hear jewelry. I hear jewelry. Uh, I can't. I can't open it with one hand uh, though. I, what? You need two hands? Uh, oh snap! Dad, 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 come here, come here, come dad, 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 open this, open this. Oh, I think it? it's gold. I think it's gold. It can't be. I'm telling you, Ooh. that is gold. Wow. Oh no way! That no way! Nice. Oh my gosh! I I did not think we we're gonna find gold in this storage unit. Oh my gosh! Hero. Hang cool, teddy bear. <laughs> There's so many birds flying around there. There's a squawking. You guys, are you guys are here tonight? All that squawking? This is going to be that lot. <laughs> that meatloaf lot. Yeah. I so can't believe noise is coming from this box. Ooh. Oh. What do we got? We got stuff. Ooh. What's in here? Okay. Come on. Personal. Oh, is it like a is that, wait, is that Native American or something? No, just somebody's beads. Just somebody's beads. Okay, yeah. that's fine. Ooh. What is that metal thing? What is this? This looks cool. Costume jewelry, maybe. Some kind. Is that like costume jewelry or something? This box looks pretty cool. Look, there's ET. Look at that. We found ET. Oh, motorcycle. Ooh, we got bangles. Oh, we got cards. We got bangles. We, we already found one Pokemon card, so there might that, even that, be that, that? Pokemon. A very small Christmas Carol oh, box. Look at that. Oh, Sega. There might be vintage video game stuff in the unit. Oh my goodness. I don't know what. what the? Oh, a pocket watch. Oh. This box is awesome. This, this is the is junk awesome. drawer. A junk drawer. It sounds some pretty good stuff for it to be a junk drawer. Uh, ooh, ooh, Thomas. Is that more jewelry? I love you. No way you found. Oh, okay. I thought you found jewelry. Open it up. Anything cool in there? Ooh. Why are you hiding it from me? Come on, come on. Dibs. What do you mean, dibs? Show it to me. Just kidding. It's empty. This guy's. Are you, are you kidding? We just found some knives, and at first I was just thinking they're basic knives. But we read the brand. This one's Kershaw. What does it say? We have had some really good experience with the oh, brand yeah. Kershaw and knives before. Yeah. Kershaw is an expensive knife brand. Nice. I want to show you guys. I want to show you guys. These people were lottery crazy. Look, this is like a hundred lottery tickets. They were. I think they probably put it all in the lottery. Cross their fingers. Buy hundred tickets. You're hundred times more likely to win. <laughs> right? Are those knives? Oh my gosh, that's a bunch of knives. Also, silverware set can be expensive. If we find a, a, a full silverware set, you can sell full silverware sets for hundreds of dollars. I, I've done it multiple times on eBay, so you really gotta keep an eye out for stuff like that. And you know where I learned that from? I learned that from my friend Bobby, who does estate sales. I did not know silverware sets were expensive until he told me. Thank you, Bobby. Yeah, there we go. That's why you gotta check. They got a silverware set right in the bottom. Um, I'm not even gonna open this right now. I just know it's something that I'm gonna sell on eBay. Ching. I found more jewelry. No. -uh. I think I found gold. No. -uh. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's hard to go through with these little things on me. Oh, these are these are stones. Oh, look at those stones. Wow. Oh, wow. That's wow. nice. Okay, put that to the side. And I see, I see gold. Okay, gloves are coming off. We're getting serious. Okay. We're getting serious here. Come on here. Come on. Ooh. Look at those earrings. Yeah, those look real. I think those might be gold. Those, those could definitely easily be gold. Nice. But what is wrapped up here? And it's got a rubber band. It's got right? a rubber band on it, so you know there's something in there. Uh huh. So you know. Come on, come on, come on. 
Oh, is that a tiger eye set in gold? Nice. Oh my Isn't gosh. Nice. Let me read this real quick. Blue Bellyick. I've never heard of that. And there's another one. Another. Look at this. One. Look at that one. Okay. Oh, it's it's 14 carat. Oh, that's nice. That's 14 carat with a blue stone in it. Oh my gosh. That's really nice. Thomas. Thomas. Yep. Yep. I wish Axel was here. You know, there's Axel. so much stuff. You know, Katie's boys, Bishop, Axel. Bishop, Axel, Quentin. Quentin. Don't forget Quentin. Yep. Quentin, man. They came down. Thank you guys for coming down for the weekend. Wish you guys could have seen us go through a storage unit. But, oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. Oh. I know. Oh. I wasn't going to tell you about oh, that. Oh, whoa, 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 Dad. Is that real? I don't know. Is that real? Okay. It's empty? Oh my goodness. I thought we almost just found a AR-15. Oh my gosh, Dad. Love you guys! That, that just almost gave me a heart attack. I was about to freak out. They paid $850 for it. That's a real weapon. Oh yeah. Oh my gosh. Okay guys, so quick little update. I moved this table from where it was because the sun started coming and I burn very easily. So I do not want to be in that sun if I don't have to. But we got a few more boxes, a little more than a few. We got a lot of stuff to go through. And I got a lot of work to do, so I gotta get moving. Check out this thing we just found. It's a huge chicken shelf. It needs to be clean, but that is awesome. Oh my gosh. And um, how much clothes are you finding, Dad? A couple bags. A couple bags. Hopefully uh, we can get an extra hand to go through the clothes. Oh my gosh, is that the pool table? That's what's left of the pool table. Oh, it got touched by the water. Yes, sir. No way. Oh my goodness. I'm trying to get to it now. Wow. That's going to be hard to get out. Five. Brand new Beanie Babies. And what is this? What is this? Didn't we just have some of these? We just sold these. We got these from another unit. The last video, last video we found these exact same glasses. Wait, do they have the Batman ones too? Imagine. Oh my gosh. It's crazy. Time for this tote, which looks amazing. This is the highlight of our storage unit, it looks like. I don't know. Oh, wow. Oh Jason. my gosh, Jason. There's like there's gonna be a bunch of vintage. Chucky. Oh, what the heck? This guy's crazy. No. This guy's. Oh my gosh. Who's it? Oh. Whoa. It's a huge ah. Uh, a a chain, chainsaw guy. So his foot must be in here somewhere. Yeah, his foot's got. I mean, there's tons of toys in here. I'm sure his foot's mixed in here somewhere. Another Jason. What? That's crazy. He's got gum attaching certain things to him. I have to look these toys up individually. This whole tote, we're probably gonna just keep this whole tote. Because I wanna show it off a little better, just make sure there's nothing really too amazing. Ooh, amazing hiding down at the bottom. Exorcist, all horror movies. This guy's a horror movie collector. Look at these toys, oh my goodness. Oh, look at this. He's got a piece of the film. Oh, really? Wow. Picture. See? Whoa, that's, that's crazy. This gets kinda be cool. Yeah, I think this whole tote's a key tote. I have to go through this whole thing at the house. And some of these things could be like a hundred dollars a piece. Oh, you know, there he is. There he is. That's he Kong. Goes. Oh, he goes on that. Yeah. Kong sits on his little throne. Oh, uh, you look down here, and what do we find? Is that teeth? A shark teeth. What in the world? Wow. See it? Oh my gosh. Are you? He's trying to bite me. It's a shark teeth. <laughs>